Hello, this is part 14, Ammo Pickup and Reload. In this video I create ammo pickups. I only created a pickup for the shotgun. The other weapons have, have infinite ammo like they did before. I created both a base ammo pickup and a ammo pickup shotgun. I also modified the player character blueprint. This is the new initial, initialization code. This is the new switching code. This now switches based on pressing 1, 2, 3, and 4 instead of the G key like before. And I modified the fire mechanism. This is the original fire mechanism for the shotgun. This is the reload section. This is the new code. Under content, third person sheet, weapons, add new folder, name it pickups, and double click on pickups, right click, select blueprint class, select actor, name this BP underscore base ammo pickup. Right click base ammo pickup. Create child blueprint class. Name this BP underscore ammo pickup shotgun B. Double click BP base ammo pickup. Add component, search for spear, add spear collision, compile and save. Double click BP ammo pickup shotgun B. Then go to pickups under military web dark drag in shotgun pickup to here and compile and save close this under content Third per sheet, weapons, double click BP underscore base gun, add a variable, name this rounds and gun, give it a type of integer, add another variable, name this rounds extra and give it a type of integer and compile and save and close this under content third per sheet weapons pickups double click bp ammo pickup shotgun b this is the blueprint that you need to program. To get on component begin overlap you can highlight the spear and right click and then select add event and then on component begin overlap.
This is the number of rounds that are going to be loaded, in this case eight. You can put uh, whatever number you want here. When you're done, compile and save. Under content, third per sheet, double click player HUD. Drag in a text. Under text, select the drop down for bind and select create binding. This is the blueprint that you need to program. When you're done, compile and save and close this. And double click player HUD. Drag in a text. Under text and select this drop down and select create binding. This is the blueprint that you need to program. When you're done, compile and save. Double click player character. Add a variable. Name this gun one. Search for BP base gun and select BP base gun. Add another variable. Name this gun 2. Variable type BP base gun. Add another variable. Name this gun 3. Type BP base gun. Create another variable. Name this gun four. And the type is BP base gun. And compile and save. Double click player character. These blueprints on the left side are the old blueprints. This was for the initialization. This is the new blueprint for the initialization. This is for the gun switching. This is the new blueprint for the gun switching. So you might as well just delete these old ones and I'm going to show you how to do the new ones. So highlight this and press delete. And highlight this and press delete. And compile, save and close. 
and double click player character. This is the initialization blueprint. This initializes the weapons. This initializes the HUD. And this is the AR4. This is grip point here. KA47 This is FP gun This is Shotgun B Double click player character. This switches the gun when you press 1, 2, 3, or 4. This is 1, this is 2, this is 3, and this is 4. This is grip point here. When you're done, compile and save. Double click player character. This is the original fire mechanism for the shotgun. This is the new code that handles the reload for the shotgun. It connects to here. and then to here and then it connects from here to here now I'll show you the code This is Reload Shotgun Hip W. This is Reload Shotgun Hip. This is 
4.3 this goes to here and I'll show this code This is eight here, this is a one here, and a one here. There's a one here. When you're done, compile and save. I have two ammo pickups in the scene. So I'm going to press play to test. I press 4 to switch to the shotgun. I just picked up one ammo, picked up the other ammo, now I'll reload. Ow. 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 Now I'll go back to... Oh, I just got killed. I'll switch to gun 4. Now I'm going to go to gun 1 and then back to gun 4 and it retains the ammo correctly so it's working. 